I think through our art and through the art that many of the artists are doing here, they're sharing their stories, their history, and together, by them sharing their stories and their history, we're working towards a future together. And the vision in the future is very much about what Sherry Balcom was saying at our Sorry Day reflection last week, is that we all need to walk beside each other in reconciliation. And it's not just today and it's not just the past week, but it's all the time. And the stories that are in all these artworks here today are timeless. And our reconciliation journey is what we can walk forward with for the future. And there's no particular beginning or end to that. So today for me, it's a celebration about what reconciliation is about. And it's a celebration about the artists who are creating the works. And it's a celebration for all of us together because we are the audience as well. And the artists are teaching us things. They're teaching us a lot about their story, their history, their culture, um, and their memories too. We also have Marlene Scary here, whose artwork has been gracing the walls of our reconciliation exhibitions for nine years. Marlene hasn't missed one of the exhibitions. Um, and her artwork is a tribute to her incredible skills as a textile artist um, and as someone who shares her stories and her history and you know the beautiful the beautiful gifts of of the of life and death i think in many ways in in sharing what you've shared with us we're very grateful to st vincent's for having a space like this it is a space that we can come to in a healthcare environment sometimes we come in here and we're not having a great day but sitting in a space that's got art that's got so many stories behind the art and simply just color and form makes everybody's day a much better day